The Duke of Sussex is facing a backlash after branding the First Amendment, which protects the right to freedom of speech, bonkers before admitting he does not fully understand it during a recent podcast interview. And Express.co.uk readers hit out at Harry, who is living in California with Meghan Markle after quitting royal duties last year, with one saying the royal has shot himself in the foot. Commenting on this website, one reader said, having successfully offended most of the UK, Harry turns his attention to offending Americans. The arrogance is amazing. Another wrote, H has been there all of five minutes. Keep digging. A third blasted. I think Harry has shot himself in the foot again. Another said, show some respect. He doesn't know what respect is. A fifth posted, so he didn't respect your traditions USA. Join the club. One more commented, we don't need more idiots here in USA, please take him back. Speaking on the Armchair Expert podcast last Thursday, Harry told host Dax Shepard, I've got so much I want to say about the First Amendment as I sort of understand it, but it is bonkers. I don't want to start going down the First Amendment route because that's a huge subject and one which I don't understand because I've only been here a short time. But, you can find a loophole in anything. You can capitalize or exploit what's not said rather than uphold what is said. The Duke's comments sparked outrage across the pond with a string of commentators hitting back at the Queen's grandson. Meghan McCain, the daughter of the late U.S. Senator John McCain and co-host of ABC's talk show The View, reminded Harry of the War of Independence. She tweeted, We fought a war in 1776 so we don't have to care what you say or think. That being said, you have chosen to seek refuge from your homeland here and thrive because all of what our country has to offer and one of the biggest things is the First Amendment. Show some utter respect. Commentator Megan Kelly added, Better to remain silent and be thought a fool than to speak and remove all doubt. Lincoln or Twain or someone smarter than Prince Harry. Ted Cruz, a senator for Texas, simply tweeted, Nice that he can say that. Fox News host Laura Ingraham blasted, Don't let the doorknob hit you, Windsor. And former Brexit party leader Nigel Farage, who has been touring the US, warned, For Prince Harry to condemn the USA's First Amendment shows he has lost the plot. Soon he will not be wanted on either side of the pond.